Well, here it is. This is the detecting giveaway. This is to celebrate 50,000 subscribers, which um, was quite a long way in the past, but it's taken me this long to get this video out. Um, a few people in the last giveaway video, which was the aquatic one, had problems understanding the rules, so I'll explain that before I even show you that what the giveaway prizes are. Basically, everything will have a number. Prize number one, two, three, four, five, six, however many prizes there is. I'll list those in the video description. If you want to win a specific prize, all you need to do in a comment on this video, and that is this video, not any other videos, this video is put prize number two. If you want to win prize number four as well, in a separate comment put prize number four. It's as simple as that. Now to win you do have to be subscribed and ideally you want to have liked five of my previous videos. I've got to admit when I chose the winners for the aquatic giveaways I didn't check. You can enter as many times as you want for as many different prizes as you want. You can enter every single day for every single prize if you want. Now this will run till the 10th of August and I'll pick the winners exactly the same way as I did with the aquatic one. I'll basically bring up a little finds box. I imagine there'll be quite a lot of entries. There was about 1100 in the aquatic one. It's possibly going to be as many if not more for the metal detecting one. So I'll bring up all the comments, bring up a little finds box with all of the comments randomized on the page. Prize number one in the finds box. Scroll down. First one I come to with, find, with prize number one wins prize number one. It's as simple as that. From that point I'll put in prize number two and I'll work my way down so it's fair. All of the entries are mixed up and I know with the last one I had 17 different prizes and I did get right to the bottom of the comments. So everybody has an equal chance of winning, unless you enter 600 times or something, then you've got a better chance of winning. If your comments get marked as spam, I do go in and mark them as not spam, so they will show. So don't worry if you've put like 40 entries or something and you're only seeing two comments. I'll rectify that before I pick the winners. So without further ado, here's what you can win in this one. Okay, here is prize one. We've got a Treasure Mountain Metal Detectors t-shirt in black and in large because I think most metal detectorists are large. Garrett Pro Pointer cover in black from Papa Doody. A map of Roman Britain which has got a lot of useful information in as well but it's got a full map of Britain showing all the roads and all the forts and everything so that is prize number one prize number two is a National Trust thermal drinking mug very good when you're on a long expedition and a solid silver National Trust commemorative coin with Queen Elizabeth II on so that is prize number two Okay, prize number three is pretty much connected to the XP Deus, which is known as a hammered hoover, because it has a habit of hoovering up all the hammered coins in the field. This is a belt mount for the control box. This is a wrist mount or arm mount for the control box. We've got a book on called England's Strike and History, which is basically a list of all the hammered coins and mints that were around at the time when people were making hammered coins. And that is a cartwheel penny. That's an ounce of copper from George III, 1797. Yeah, it's in pretty good condition as well. So that's prize number three. Okay, prize number four is a big Garrett Metal Detectors finds pouch. It goes around your waist. And a pair of neoprene gloves where the fingers fold back. I like shooting gloves, but they're pretty good for metal detecting. It also includes a couple of wartime items. One is a trench art half pence from our side of things. The George V coin with hell stamped in it. A lot of people weren't too happy about going to war and they kind of vented that on the coins. That's a one in a million one. Definitely a keeper. And this one is from the other side. From the German side. Just before everything kicked off. This is from 1938. 
Uh, and there you've got the old Nazi party symbol with a big eagle standing on top of it. Silver. So there you go. That's prize number four. Actually, I forgot to mention, in that finds pouch is a cover for the Garrett Pro Pointer. So that's also included in prize four as well. Right, just a very quick rundown of prizes five through nine. Prize five, six and seven is a Garrett Pro Pointer cover. I'll just hand those out at random. Prize number eight is a Detechnics X Pointer cover. And prize number nine is a White's Bullseye TRX cover. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. If you're in any doubt, look in the video description. I've got them all listed. Prize number ten is another flask cup thing, except this one is a monster. Hence the name, Fat Boy. So that's prize number ten. Prize number 11 has a very mine labby sort of a feel. This, yes, it has been well thumbed through. This is my personal book on the mine lab. That's what came with it. It's the Andy Sabish book. And that, in conjunction with the instruction manual you get, is a very good grounding for the use of the e track. This also covers the Explorer as well, so if you've got an Explorer or an e track, you will find this book invaluable. Sorry it's a bit dog eared, but I don't need it anymore, you might as well have it. We've also got a Mine Lab beanie hat, which will be useful for this coming winter. And there's also a Mine Lab stress ball as well, which hopefully you will never need, but you know, we all need one from time to time. And two pens, again with a Mine Lab logo on, and a Mine Lab carabiner attachment keyring thingy. That's it, that's prize number 11. Okay, for prize number 12, we have some modern silver for your perusal. This is a half ounce hammerhead shark coin. 0.999 silver, so it's pretty much pure silver. And that's from Australia. Really nice coin, mint condition. So that's prize number 12. Prize number 13 is another shark coin, exactly the same as prize number 12, so you get two chances to win one of those great coins. Again, that's in mint condition as well, solid silver, half ounce coin. Prize number 13. Now then, prize number 14 is a Canadian maple, and that is one ounce of solid silver. 2015 issue, so that one's a very new one. Still in the coin capsule, I've never had it out. That one is also in mint condition. Prize number 14. Prize number 15 is one really that I should have kept for my collection because I found this in one of my videos and this is a Queen Anne love token from the early 1700s. It's basically a sixpence that's been folded on the top and the bottom to make the characteristic S shape and that would have been given as a token of affection from a man to a woman to spark up a conversation. The only reason I'm giving this away is because I actually found a one almost exactly the same a couple of years earlier. So this is a swap. So that's the love token and that is prize number 15. Well hopefully you found those giveaway prizes to your liking. Now just get entering. Enter as many times as you want for as many of the prizes as you want. There's no geographical restrictions, they can go anywhere. And I'm not limiting one person to one prize so if there's a one in a billion chance that somebody has all the prizes, so be it. It didn't happen with the aquatic one, strangely, but I think out of the 17 in the aquatic giveaway, there was 16 different winners. There was one lad lucky enough to win two prizes. So as I say, enter as many times as you want for anything you want. Just put each entry in a separate comment, so that when I bring up all the comments, it randomizes them. That just avoids anybody being right at the top with prize number 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Because that just wouldn't be fair. Remember this will run till 12 midnight, that's English time, on the 10th of August. I suppose in reality it'll actually finish whatever time I get up in the morning following that. Which is usually pretty early, so get your entries in 
before the 10th, please, and you will stand a pretty good chance of winning. I'm expecting quite a few entries because everybody loves free stuff, but just enter. If you want the stuff, enter. You've got as good a chance as anybody else of winning. Thanks very much for watching. Thanks for your support over the years and getting me to this milestone of 50,000 subscribers and beyond. Excellent. Very much appreciated. It's good to be in a position to give something back. So I really love to give stuff back. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video. Okay, for prize number 12, we... Is that 12 or 11? 